What's good, YouTube man? It's your boy Jerry S. Man, back with another video, man. As y'all boys can see by the title, meet the woman addicted to eating her husband's ashes. This right here is the most wildest shit I ever seen. You're mad disrespectful, to me. bro. This is like toxic on the next level. Like, bro, like, bro said in the comments right here, bro. She took, she, she took the same. My husband looking like a snack to a whole different level. She took it to a whole different level. Bro, eating your husband ashes is crazy. Imagine if you was to tell his family about this. They wouldn't be fucking with you. I ain't gonna hold you. They will violate your shit. Y'all y'all tell me would y'all be cool with that. Or tell me would y'all do something like that. If y'all would personally, bro, that, that's just you, bro. Me, I'm not. That's I don't, I don't know. Y'all but like, come subscribe. I'm trying to react to like different things, you know, interesting ass things. Cause some people be doing some crazy stuff in this world, bro. For real. Like this is wild, bro. Let me make sure my own stuff still recording, bro. Cause I am I've been making so many videos. My PC running out of storage. This is Casey. I'm twenty six years Casey, old. Yeah. I'm from Fayetteville, Tennessee. And I'm addicted to carrying around my husband's urn. That's wild. I take my wrong, husband everywhere. Nothing, nothing ain't wrong with her, like, taking her husband everywhere. Nothing, nothing is wrong with that. Her taking her husband everywhere. You know what I'm saying? With her. You know what I'm saying? She making it seem like as if he's still here. Yeah. Nothing is wrong with that. But eating, eating the ashes is a whole different breed. To the grocery store. Shopping. Ooh, babe, look at that. That's neat. To the movies. Out to eat. Anywhere I go, he goes. I sleep with him. Night, baby, I love you. When I go grocery shopping, I buy the foods that he likes. Which is understandable. When I cook, I cook what he likes. I don't eat it, but I cook for him. That's if I'm watching TV, he's there with me. You want to watch this? If somebody says, hey, who is that? I'm like, this is my husband. Some people laugh. They think I'm playing, but it, I mean, it's serious. I, it's my husband. Yeah, take shit. So I'm by her Casey name. and Sean were married in 2009. All right, so we finna see how he died. I want to see how he died. You know, our Peter Shine. After dating for 10 months. Dang. Everything I had ever wanted in a man was right in front of me. Crazy. And it felt kinda, so it's great. It's hard to find that, they too. They fell in love and it's hard the to find soulmates that from day one. The two and a half years that they were together, I think, was the only time that Casey was truly, truly happy. Dang. Their marriage was picture perfect until Sean suffered a severe asthma attack two months ago. That's my tech. Dang, bro. That's tough. The doctor came in, and the look on his face was telltale. It was the day, the day my world stopped turning. The day my life fell apart. I know how that feels, too. Oh, baby, I miss you. Dang, bro. Though Casey initially found comfort by having her husband's ashes at her side, her addiction has recently evolved. I guess with the transfer of his cremains, you know, some got into the cardboard box as well, and they spilled out on my hands. And I didn't want to wipe wipe them off because that's my husband. I don't want to yeah, wipe yeah, them away. Which is understandable. Um, so I just licked it off my fingers, and here I am today, almost two months later, fingers, and so I just. Licked it off. I don't want to wipe him away. Um, so I just. Oh, that's crazy. But I understand where she coming from, though. At the same time, because, you know what I'm saying? The ashes got on her finger. She didn't want to wipe him off because she just felt like. That would be mad disrespectful, bro. Which is understandable, but after that one time, I would have never did it again, though. Let's see if she continued to do this. Licked it off my fingers, and here I am today, almost two months later, and I can't stop. What the fuck? Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! 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 No way. No way. No way. What the fuck? I wonder 
what this tastes like. I'm eating my husband. What do you gain from that? First, I like my finger. And I don't just dip it in. I swirl around to kind of feel and get it caked on there good. And then I just eat it. It tastes like... What the fuck? It... What the fuck is that? What the fuck is this? Bro, what the fuck is this? It look like it's bugs and everything in that shit, bro. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Bro, what is this, bro? It tastes like rotten eggs, sand, and sandpaper. What the? Bro, what? Bro, right? What? What the? F it tastes like rotten eggs, sand, and sandpaper. What? What? Rotten eggs, sand? That's, uh, what the fuck? Bro, what? Rotten eggs, sandpaper. You what? What? That that don't even sound good together. What type of combination is that? Ugh, the fuck? Bro, this weird. This is what you call weird, bro. I feel bad for her husband. Bro, what the fuck? Oh, hell no, nah, bro. But I've Sean is bro. No, bro, listen. Sean is in heaven fucking like cussing her ass out, bro. What the fuck are you doing? Like, you taking it to a whole different level. It looked like some fucking bugs was in that bag, man. Like, bro, she is tripping, bro. Grown to love that taste. She is tripping, It started bro. as not, not wanting to get rid of him, and it's progressed into eating him. She is Plus tripping. 42. So what's she going to do? What's she going to do when all the ash is gone? What's she going to do? Pains since my husband passed away. She is Basically, the only thing I'm eating are his ashes. Casey eats her husband's ashes five to six times a day. When I open up the urn, I get a sense of happiness. It's okay. like an adrenaline rush for me. And the, the more I eat, the more excited I get until I realize there's not a lot left. Then a few minutes later, I feel horrible because I did it. And you when. I got Sean back from the crematory. He weighed six pounds. He is closer to five pounds now, so I have consumed right at a pound. That's hard. And you can to still be eating. eating my husband. Very few people know that Casey is eating her husband's ashes. She recently shared this secret with her mother. When Casey actually told me that she was eating what, what Sean's what, ashes. What, what, I, what, I wonder what she said. Karen, you, Karen, you better, bro, you, no, Karen, you better, bro, let's just see what Karen said. Bro. And I need to do what I need to help her get past that. Yeah, Knowing yes. that a pound is already gone is hard. And that's one reason I need help. Because I'm going to run out soon. And I don't know if I'll be able to hold it together any better than I'm doing now. What am I going to do when I go to bed at night and there's just an urn there and there's nothing in it? But can Casey quit her addiction to eating her husband's ashes? Can her family she, stop? And she's eating that shit like it's fucking powder. What the fuck? Oh, this is fucking... This is insane, Before it's bro. This too is late. weird, bro. Just want so her to stop weird. eating the ashes. That's my one and only hope for my daughter. Hopefully she gets over this, but this I is have to weird, stop eating bro. Him. I've lost him once. This time it'll be my fault that I lose him again. And I don't want to do that. So and it's going to get to that point really soon if I don't get help. Stop eating the fucking ashes. Stop. Like, what are you doing? She wants to reveal the truth to her cousin Stephanie and ask for help. 
I hope she got I'm feeling face. anxious a little bit, um, nervous. I don't want to lose the trust that we have. I'm ready to tell her and I'm ready to get it out. Uh, I have something to tell you, Stephanie. Oh no. I don't want you to freak out and I don't want you to get mad and I really don't want you to push me away and not talk to me anymore. You know, I carry around Sean everywhere. Um, I've been eating his ashes. Look at her face. Look at her fucking face. Look at her damn I've been face. eating his ashes. Face of fucking shame. Like, what are you doing? What? Mo. Face of shame. This is what I call this. Face of shame. Like, what are you... She's in her head. She's thinking right now, like, what are you doing? I never heard of this before. Why? She don't know what to say. Like, he'll always be a part of me mm -hmm. because right. I'm eating him, you know? Yeah, but I don't know what to think about that. Exactly. I, mean, I want to know what to say. It is a kind kind of a little too much, maybe. Yeah, I don't... that's what I'm saying. Like, okay, the one time you did it, okay, I understand where you was coming from. You didn't want to wipe off, you know what I'm saying? Type shit. But you continue to eat him. What the fuck? Like, that's weird. It's weird. What? Like, that is weird. The fuck? I don't quite understand why Casey would feel as far as eating the ashes would bring her closer to him. I just don't, I don't understand I don't, that part. I don't understand I don't understand either. why she would want to keep eating it. I don't know either. You tell so me, like, Stephanie. When God you're God eating God ashes, God like, God what's God going through your mind at that God. moment? It comforts me, and then I do it, and then it makes me sad because and then you I'm so... It makes you sad, and then you continue to do it, and then I, all I say, all I got to say is I hope she get, I hope she got help. Because, damn, what the fuck? I ain't never, bro, I ain't never heard of this shit before, bro. Never in my life. Totally losing my bro, let me make sure my shit's still recording, bro. All right, but my shit's still recording. Cause if it wasn't recorded, I was gonna be hella pissed. And I was gonna break my and damn PC. I'm so scared that I'm pretty close to the edge right now. And if I eat him, like all of him, it may push you. Over. It may push me over. Right. But then again, where's my comfort gonna be? I don't want to be. Oh, there's a little crazy lady that ate her husband. But it's comforting. You know, when we first started, he was six pounds, and right. now he's almost five pounds. Right. You know, and in another six months, not even six months, you know, maybe three or four months mm -hmm. from now, at the rate I'm going, he'll be gone. Right. Who am I going to hold at night? Mm -hmm. Who am I going to take with me everywhere? Yeah. What am I going to do to comfort myself then? Mm -hmm. It's hard to think about that. That's that's insane. I ain't never heard of. I ain't never, ever, 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 ever in my life heard of this before, bro. Never in my life. I've never seen nothing like this before. If some of the things people do in this world will blow your mind. And this is crazy. When I seen the title of this video, I said, I said, what? What? I didn't, I, I just said, but I got to react to it, bro. I, 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 I said, I said, I told myself, I said, I want to react to some strange events here, or do some, you know what I'm saying? You know? Because I'd be watching, I was watching DJ Ghost yesterday, and I was like, damn, like, this video is pretty interesting. Like, you know, let me react to some different things. You know what I'm saying? And I said, I saw this. I said, oh, man. Oh, man. This is crazy. This is insane. And it, it, it kind of blew my mind a little bit. Because, like, I never, ever saw nothing like this before in my life. Like, she was ready to be. Y'all seen how it look, bro. Y'all seen how it look, bro. Bro, y'all seen how that shit look, bro. In that bag, bro. 
Y'all seen how it looked in the bag, bruh. Bruh. Bruh, y'all seen how it looked in the bag, bruh. And then I just ate it. Bruh, y'all seen how it looked in the bag, bruh. Hold on. It tastes like... Y'all see that, bruh? Come on, bruh. What in the world? Come on. Come on, now, dog. Play some two. Man, y'all boys like, comment, subscribe. I really ain't got much to end this. I ain't got much to goddamn say. I can't hold it, dog. I'm a, I'm a probably, I'm gonna try to find another interesting stream. I'm gonna do some video. Cause this shit is pretty interesting, bro. It's pretty interesting. Y'all tell me what y'all think. Y'all tell me what y'all think about this, like. Is she crazy or not? In my opinion, bro, she was crazy. After the first time she did it, the first time, okay, it was understandable. But after that, man, bro, it's crazy. I'm sorry. I don't think I never, ever, ever in my life do something like that. Bro. But, you know, RP to Sean. You know, hopefully she got over the addiction. And hopefully she's doing way better. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, you know what I'm saying? And things of that nature. I would like, come subscribe, man. I see y'all boy in this video. I'm on this bit. Yeah.